Lesson 6 Choosing a Broker You will learn What is a brokerage account? Choosing a broker Choosing a trading software Margin and cash accounts How to fund your account Trading Trading problem. A trader must know himself and protect against his own weaknesses Remnants of a stock operator. Choosing a broker. To trade options, you need an online brokerage account. A brokerage account is simply an account that allows you to purchase assets such as stocks, options, Bitcoin, etc. There are various online brokers to choose from that will allow you to trade stock options. Most brokers now have commission-free trading thanks to Robinhood. The top online brokers are TD Ameritrade, Fidelity Investments, Charles Schwab, E-Trade, and Interactive Brokers. We use TD Ameritrade primarily because of its thinkorswim trading platform. The software is user-friendly, reliable, and very fluent. Our strategies are designed around key indicators, which I am sure can be found on other platforms as well. However, the custom scans we've built along with the advanced automated orders we use on the Thinkorswim platform gives TD Ameritrade a competitive advantage over the other players. Many retail brokers do not offer these features. They are still playing catch up. It is common for traders to have several accounts. For a while, I used Thinkorswim only for scanning and charting. I placed my day trades with E-Trade and my swing trades with Ally to keep my calls low until TD Ameritrade eliminated commissions. Now, I have several accounts with TD Ameritrade that I use for our different strategies. If you currently have a broker that you enjoy, no worries, do like I did. Use our scans and workstations on Thinkorswim to generate the best ideas and place the order on your broker of choice. It's a win-win situation. TD Ameritrade offers the following account types. Individual, which is a personal account, retirement, business, investment clubs, and or trading accounts for your kids. My kids will have to make their own money. They have their own trading accounts. Cash account account versus margin account. account. Technically, to become an active day trader, you are required to begin with at least $25,000 or more. This would allow you to establish a standard margin account. A margin account gives you leverage or a loan in a sense, meaning if you have $25,000 to trade with, your broker will allow you to purchase up to $50,000 worth of stock. This could be of great value if you know what you're doing. However, I suggest steering clear of using other people's money until you have proven to be unconsciously competent with consistently producing profitable results. In other words, don't even think about using other people's money until you know what the heaven you are doing. You do not want to be a victim of a margin call. A margin call is when your broker comes to collect payment they will demand you to deposit more money into your brokerage account or demand that you sell every position you have to get their money if necessary if you are like most people you probably have less than twenty-five thousand to invest no worries i have the perfect solution for you establish a cash account a cash account will allow you to actively day trade options as long as you have the funds available to trade This is a legal loophole to avoid the pattern day trader rule. The rule states that day traders must have a minimum of 25,000 to actively day trade. This is why I said technically earlier. The benefit of a cash account is 
your trading balance will reset every day. This allows you to compound your earnings daily. For example, if you start with $100 on Monday and make $100 before the day's end, you will have $200 in your trading account the next day. If you double that 200 on Tuesday, the next day you will have $400 and so on. It's levels to this, as Meek Mill would say. This compounding concept of leveling up is the premise and foundation of our 100 to a million trading strategy, which you will learn in semester four. You want and need to have tier two cash account approval with TD Ameritrade to actively trade options. Opening a trading account is like creating a social media or cash app account. After completing the personal information questions, the next set of questions will ask about your risk tolerance and investment experience. If you're a new trader, answer these questions wisely. You want to select speculation as your investment objective with a high tolerance for risk. In their eyes, you need to appear to have some investment experience, decent liquid capital, and income. If you do not, their algorithm probably will not approve your account for options trading. Money comes and goes fast. This is certainly not for the faint at heart. Trading is the hardest way to make easy money. It's an emotional roller coaster. However, it's lucrative and rewarding when you succeed. Everything you learn in this trading course will help you become the best in class assuming you possess the discipline to execute. You just need approval for options trading. We will help minimize your risk. Once you fund your trading account, you can trade as often as you desire as long as there are funds available. If you fail to establish a cash account and you have less than 25,000 to trade, you will be subjected to the three day trades per week rule. Trading with three trades a week is not impossible, but very challenging considering that we have a plethora of opportunities each trading day. If you place a trade on Monday and two day trades on Tuesday, you're done for the rest of the week. You will have to wait until the following week to trade again. This would suck pretty bad because Wednesdays, Thursdays and Fridays are the best days to trade weekly options contracts. How to fund, How your, to account. fund your account. Last but not least, when your account has been approved, simply connect your bank account and routing number to fund your new brokerage account. You can make as many deposits or withdrawals as you desire. Your new account will also offer check writing privileges and a debit card that would allow you to make purchases directly from your trading account. Paper trading. Paper trading. Once you've established your new trading account, do not rush to trade real money to make money. It never ends well. It's best to begin trading using a paper trading account first to tame your emotions. Most online brokers offer paper trading. Paper trading gives you the ability to trade fake money real time. It allows you to practice and perfect your skill set and establish good trading habits. It will also help you cultivate the discipline to stick to your trading plan. New traders are encouraged to use Thinkorswim's paper trading account. It's free for 60 days. Just download the app. You can practice using our workstations and algorithms with a paper trading account. However, the scans can only be used on a live account, which is free with TD Ameritrade. They do not have account minimums. We will cover paper trading in detail in semester five, graduation. Masterclass, Masterclass summary. summary. Choose a credible options broker such as TD Ameritrade. Set up a cash account if you have less than 25,000 to invest. Use Thinkorswim as your trading platform to benefit from our scans, workstations, and algorithms. Choose a broker that has paper trading capabilities. Trader, Trader profile. profile. Trader. 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 Stanley Druckenmiller. Quote, 
The way to build long-term returns is the preservation of capital and hitting home runs. End quote. Profile. Profile. Stanley, Stanley Freeman Druckenmiller is an American investor, hedge fund manager, and philanthropist. He is the former chairperson and president of Duquesne Capital, which he founded in 1981. Net worth, net worth, four point four billion dollars. Masterclass. Cheerio. 